of your city crisscross applesauce and your face in the front. I love seeing your beautiful faces. Welcome to our 7th Annual Relay Recess Schools vs. Cancer event. We are elated to have such special guests in our school. Relay Recess is a wonderful program that we use to reinforce and increase the knowledge of healthy behaviors such as healthy eating, sun safety, and physical activity. Survivors, I want to say thank you for being here with us today and allowing us to celebrate your triumph and your perseverance. Please stand as I call your name so that we can honor you. We also have several survivors that weren't able to attend today. We will also acknowledge their name as well. Maybe Vasquez. Virginia Sella. Adriana Gonzalez, Lorena, Lorena Montes, Laura Ramirez, Latasha Glover, Ernie Toscano, Berta Carrera, Ophelia Flores, Mitzi Branscom, Rita Hawkins, Hermina Cordero, Fidelina Camarena, Amanda Seely, Dana Strader, Michael Anson, and Rita Hurst. If there are any other survivors, please join us at the front so we can, we can recognize you as well. Caregivers are an integral part in our survivors' battle against cancer. If you are or have been somebody's caregiver, please stand so that we can honor you with a round of applause as well. At this time, we would all we would like to have a moment of silence in memory of our cancer warriors who have lost their hard-fought battle to cancer, including Rita Markle, Hannah Simmons, and Rachel Wilson. Thank you. Now I would like to introduce a special guest speaker. He was a Dillman student and sat where you are sitting. I know this because I was his kindergarten teacher. He has fought a tough battle against cancer and was successful. He's currently a junior at Motion High School. Please join me in welcoming Matthew Alarcón. Hello, my name is Benjamin Alarcón, and I am cancer. I would like to thank Mrs. Tovar and Ms. URC for inviting me to be here. And for inviting me to be to the wall today. It is an honor to be here. Having events like the Relay Recess brings awareness to people about cancer and ways we can help against the cancer fight. There may be a time in your life when someone you may know is diagnosed with cancer. Cancer is a battle, but with new technology, new research, and new medicines coming out every year, more and more people are surviving this disease. I was diagnosed with brain cancer May 1st, 2018. I have been through three brain surgeries, chemotherapy, Proton radiation and lost all mobility for a short time due to a massive brain injury. But I am still here getting better each day. I never thought I would be able to get through the obstacles I have been through, but by staying focused on not giving up and having a relationship with God and a community that loved, created, and supported me, I was able to make it through the hard times. No matter what difficulties come your way in life, we have two choices. Are you going to give up or are you going to stand up and fight? I choose to stand up and fight every day. Thank you all for being here today to bring awareness to the cancer fight and to those who battle it every day. 
Thank you. participated in Coins for a Cure earlier this year. The purpose of this fundraiser was to aid in the fight against cancer and to show our students that no matter how small we are, we all can help. Together we can make a difference. Dillman raised a total of $3,282.61. We are going to go ahead and present them with a check with that amount. Thank you. 
know that we have set up a survivor's lounge in the library with refreshments and a place to sit and rest. You are also welcome to sit in the If you cannot stay for the entire time to understand, our closing ceremony will be at 2.30 in the gym. Thank you, survivors, once more for attending today. Teachers and students, if we will go ahead and line the, our path for our walk this afternoon for our survival lap. Very nice. That was so sweet. Absolutely. Hey, what up, man? Oh, no. <laughs> slept real hard. Yeah. Is this cheese? It's not sweet. It's not sweet. Oh, okay. I'll just Sweet. 